Japan. Everybody's here. Mario, welcome to the castle. Princess Peach should arrive here shortly. And now, Princess Peach. God, that was the worst Toad voice ever. <laughs> Greetings to all of you. I'm so glad everyone could be here on this special day. The Star Rod stolen by Bowser has been returned to its rightful place in Star Haven. Peace has once again returned to the Mushroom Kingdom. Above us, the stars shine with more beauty and power than ever before. It seems that they're sending us their thanks. Mario. Gambario, Cooper, Bombette, Parakeri. Bo, Watt, Sushi, Lackalester, and everybody across the lands of the Mushroom Kingdom. We've reigned peace because regained peace because of your efforts. Thank you very much indeed. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. I hope that the Mushroom Kingdom will enjoy peace and prosperity for a long time to come. Perhaps forever. Not if the next few Mario games have anything to say about it. This is my heartfelt wish. So, let's celebrate! Enjoy the festivities, everyone! Yes, that is the end of the game. Paper Mario has come to a close. And remember that job Luigi said he had to do? That job is... Directing the parade that, like, goes on during the credits. This is perhaps one of my absolute favorite credit sequences. This is an amazing credit sequence here. You see all the characters from the game. And, yeah. Let's see, we got the toads walking around, we got all of our party members, confetti all around. Wait, don't throw a twink. Oh, I'm kidding. Oh, they're riding in the baby carriage, of course. I feel really bad that Christian Cosplayer couldn't have been here with me to finish this off, but, well, I suppose my very first LP that I did by myself, I kind of needed to finish it off myself, I suppose. Dun, dun, dun. Chuck Quizmo and the Toadettes throwing a baton. Oh, I just realized Chuck Quizmo is a worm. Like a bookworm. I just realized that. I always thought that he like, had a tiny body and that was a cape following him. He's a bookworm. Okay. Cooper Bros and their Trojan Bowser and a bunch of bob bombs. Ah, bob bombs get the revenge for trapping for the Cooper Bros trapping them in the basement back in Chapter 1. Man, guys, I can't believe this project's over. Man, it's gone on a lot longer than it should have, but... Up there's Colorado and his wife riding on the tuna whale. Stupid hiatuses and school just kind of got in the way, but... At least I know this project was able to come to a close before summer was over. Now I can focus on Twilight Princess and... Um, Sonic. And if it, Avatar isn't finished by this point, then Avatar as well. Oh yeah, the chain shop's still follow, uh, running after Tut and Koopa. <laughs> and then there's Buzzar. See, she had babies. See, that's proof that she was a she. She had eggs. Which I found really creepy, but whatever. <laughs> now there's three chain shops running after Tut and Koopa. And then there's Bootler. Ah, water. It is essential. Kabo Baba! Why is he floating like a circus balloon and what the heck is heart? Ah, the boos are carrying off Tubba Baba's body and like the heart's trying to catch up with it. Nice. Ah, apparently the Goomba King went blasting off into a tree. Just like when he uh, took off like Team Rocket as usual, just like Bowser did. And then there's the Red Blue Koomba Bros. Man, that's a major blast from the past. So much nostalgia comes running back when you see these credits of all the things that you've done in this awesome, awesome game. Yoshi's and Raphael the Raven. 
Hi, Yoshi's Island. That's another great game. If I ever get a chance, I would like to LP it, but of course they won't put it on the virtual console yet. Yoshi's Island! Yeah! Love that game. It's awesome. I've actually been debating on whether to play Yoshi's Story on the virtual console. I've heard mixed reviews about it, so... I don't know. I kind of like draw my own conclusions, but if, like, everybody says it's horrible, then... I kind of don't want to waste my money, but... I don't know. Yoshi Kids! Huff and Puff! Hey, I just noticed the Yoshi Kids are, like, formed in a rainbow. Haha, <laughs> gourmet guy. Eat him, gourmet guy! Oh, and the Yoshi Kids eat him. Nice. Huff and Puff, you deserve that. You've caused kids so much torment over the years. You've probably got to be one of the hardest bosses in the game. If not, probably the second hardest. Actually, if not, yeah, second hardest, because the anti-guys are the hardest. But they're optional, so I don't know. Crystal... Two Crystal Kings? What did you... Form, like, copies of yourself? Oh, it's a Duplicos! Yeah, I was mad at them too, Crystal King. I hate Duplicos. What the... Another one? Oh, that one was a Duplicos too. So is that the real one, or what? And the Crystal Bits just carry him away. Whee! <laughs> Wait, who's Junior Troopa fighting? Oh, he's fighting Kami Koopa. I forgot about that. They're having a magic fight. Come on, get her, Junior Troopa. I can't believe I'm rooting for that kid, but still. I'd rather see him win than Kami Koopa. Hammer Bros, and then there's Bowser sulking, as usual. Haha, <laughs> they just fried Bowser. And then they get theirs off screen. Bowser torches them. Haha. Uh -huh. uh, this game was so awesome. And now comes my favorite part in the credits. The night sequence. This is just so amazing for an N64 game. And the uh, Star Spirits have been demoted to Christmas trees. Or, like, demoted to be put on Christmas trees. This is amazing what they do here. With just paper and lights and everything. This is just an amazing credit sequence, but this is by far my favorite part. Yes, I think this is one of the very last N64 games to be released, if not the last. Because it was released in February of 2001, at the very, very, very end of the N64's life cycle. Before the GameCube got its time to shine. Amazing Daisies! You are a great way to level up, my friends. Great way to level up. I really thought I was going to be under level, but... I guess I wasn't. I am... I was actually kind of where I usually am. Why does Wisterwood have lights all over him? And then there's the sun. Somehow it's not... He, did, he didn't appear during the sun phase of the credits. He appears during night, which makes no sense, but whatever. Oh, the Shy Guys. And the toy box is colored with neon lights. And General Shy Guy has started a group of... Go-Go dancers or something, I don't know. He started his own little band. This is an awesome thing. Like, awesome credits, awesome credits. It's such an amazing game. I've, I've had fun doing this LP, I really have. Uh, I guess I should start saying special thanks here. Um, thank you to Christian Cosplayer for co-commentating with me on a few of these. On uh, Chapter 3, of course, and um, a little bit of Chapter 8. Um, I feel bad that you couldn't have been here with me in the credits, but I guess that's how things work out, but sorry. But I um, want to thank all of my friends on YouTube. Um... See Morrow Tricks, Blink and You Miss It, Masayanella, Koshi Sushi, Grand Pyro, um, Stormy, um, Hunter, GT, all of you guys are awesome. Best Metroid fan, Dark Fool, you guys are awesome and I really thank you for watching my videos. Tinka, Tinka Two Legs, um, who may have had his account changed, I hope not, but. I have that resolved for him, but anyway. Um, so yeah, that's basically all my thank yous. Of course, I have to thank you guys, the fans. Uh, thank you so much for watching all my LPs and just staying with me throughout this Paper Mario LP. 
And now Peach and Mario are at their house watching fireworks. And the end screen is here. This Let's Play is officially over. There is no... Um... I have nothing to show after this. I mean, there's the letters and stuff like that, but I really didn't care about that. There's many games you can play if you do uh, stuff for, um... Koopa Coot and Koopa Village, but that's a waste of time. In my opinion, all you do is just get coins. So yeah, guys. This is it. Another Let's Play is come and gone. Wow. Uh, I won't be starting any more Let's Plays at the moment. Uh, I want to just focus on Twilight Princess and Sonic. And then after that, Ocarina of Time starts and a few other things I have planned up my sleeve. So yeah, look forward to all the stuff in the future. So yeah, guys, uh, thank you so much for watching my Let's Play Paper Mario, one of my absolute favorite games for the N64, if not one of my top three favorites. Alright guys, this is Lightning Spirit 78 signing out. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will leave you to the fireworks for about another minute or so. Take care guys. Bye bye. <laughs>